or this doesn't make a whole lot of sense. This one has a dead horse in it. It doesn't have any plaque. It's got it's just a dead horse, and looks like there were some other dead animals at one point. Cowboy hat. Uh, the aftermath. Yeah, it's a... Huh. Hey guys, so I just want to let you know a few new ways that you can get a hold of me outside of YouTube. The first is through Facebook, where I update on upcoming trips. The second is through Instagram, and that's where I post exclusive photos from the trip. And the third is a way for you guys to donate to the channel if you want, and it's through a Patreon page. Alright guys, sorry to waste your time, hope you like the video. Hey, good morning guys. So today, we are doing a bunch of different stuff. Um, so we're heading back into the town today, going to explore a bunch of the, the city square again during the day. They also have a bullfighting ring which we're going to go check out. So this morning we woke up to something that we're still not sure what's going on. Um, it was a massive, huge, loud bell. Uh, almost like a ringing, like uh, we thought it was maybe a volcano, not a volcano, but a... Uh, Earthquake, yeah. <laughs> we thought it was maybe in like an earthquake siren alarm because it just went off for 30, 40 seconds straight, loud enough to wake us up. You could hear it all across the city. And then it went off in another spot. So Chris was busy looking that up this morning but couldn't find anything. So we're not sure and people at the front desk didn't even know what we were talking about. So unless it was all in our heads, all four of us, I'm not sure what it was. But. Nobody else seems to be alarmed about it, so we just carried on with our day. Well, we think we may have found that bull fighting ring. We were getting worried because uh, on the map it said it was right here, and we didn't see anything because it was just a main street. But, looks promising. We're going to go check it out, and we won't leave Adam behind. get to go in and check it out okay so we are in we're gonna just gonna go take some photos check it out there's nothing going on today but uh, we're able to get in the locked door so that's good yeah it's it's really nice that we got to go up here we arrived at the gate and was locked and there happened to be a guy I think he's just cleaning on the other side of the gate and Chris asked uh, luckily he speaks Spanish so he asked if we could go in and check it out he said yeah sure so this is awesome a lot of firsts on this trip. Never been to a bull fighting or any sort of fighting ring, I guess. I haven't even been to a people fighting ring. Ah, oh, that's kind of cool. It keeps blowing it for so long. Okay. Maybe it was a train that this morning instead of the uh, earthquake warning system we thought, but I've never heard a, a train that blows its horn for 30 seconds or more at a time. Oh well. No yelling, no running, no pushing, or else the bulls will get you. I got one. I stand over there. I'm pretty sure they probably yell in here. Yeah. Uh, I'm not. I'm not going to say that's the fact, but I'm pretty sure they're going to yell in here. Yeah. <laughs> so just down the street around the corner from the bullfighting ring is a, I guess a museum, and it is free, at least we we're in for free. So make sure you check it out if you're in this area and you are interested in seeing what the bullfighting was like. Um, it seems like it's pretty cool. 50th anniversary of the bull ring, so Okay. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. I wouldn't want that to be chase, 
chasing me around a ring. Oh, nice. I also thought that we Almost like the design to look like it is. Yeah. Even got the press boxes at the bottom. That's true. <laughs> There's this one. So the goal was you kill the bull or you kill it? That's, yeah, pretty much. Those were your options. Look at this. The Cluster Motorsport, Monte Aguilar, November 14, 1982. Uh, this this bull was 460 kilograms. Whew. That's a big guy. This dude right here. Yeah. Yeah, I would have a hard time watching that. I don't know if I would want to watch the actual thing, but. I guess they do that here. I was going to say, I didn't realize that they did it in Mexico as well as... Uh... Uh, I didn't either until today. I read it this morning that they do it here on the 14th of August. Hmm. Or at least on the 14th of Being chased by this? Yeah, I'm going out of it. Fuzzy guy. What is fun about that? It's a challenge, Catherine. I'll get them there. <laughs> like, I'd watch it from there only. Yeah, I don't think I'd run. <laughs> Problem with pirate <laughs> observer. <laughs> These people die here. Oh, look at this. Here's the event. In 2009, 24 bulls. They got all the weights. Oh, wow. They're all like at least 440 kilograms. 